Here we are, New York City. This week, we will be attending the Masters of Dance competition, and it's gonna be tough. This is our first time showing up. And Kathy, who we thought would be in Ohio, she's here in New York City. Last time she beat you, it was bad. A perfect score. She wants to do it again. You gonna let it happen? I have brought back Anthony Burrell as hey, our God. guest choreographer. The dance that Anthony has choreographed and has visioned is going to require a girl. So we're coming into New York City and we're gonna hold an open audition and look for a new dancer. We both have decided upon number 80516. Victoria! Victoria comes from Studio Lurkin and they have a fabulous reputation. And it's gonna be kind of fun if Abby recognizes Victoria and now Victoria's on our team. The group number this week is called Runaways. Lots of privileged children run away from home. It's a problem in society today. If I can do it in an artistic way, in a respectful way, but I can make the judges see something and feel something and learn something, why not take the opportunity? So the group dance is going to be like the Day of the Dead, and it's a celebration, even though death, which is not so much a celebration, is going on. This all... See, look, look at my, you have to watch and pay attention to detail. You stop and do everything way too fast. Victoria seems like she's a pretty well-rounded dancer. She is not shirking or shunning to Anthony's sometimes brutal coaching, and she is completely portraying the role that we want her to for this group number. Abby, did Anthony come to do that group? Yeah. You want to really I'm know the truth, best. what my real opinion is? Yes. I think he's wonderful, but he's the kind of choreographer. They choreograph for themselves, and they want the kid to look like them. There's a difference between being an amazing dancer and being an amazing choreographer. Right. This is a really important number for me, and I want not only my kids to learn a lesson, but maybe to teach the people in the audience a lesson. And I want to be Kathy, too. I think that this number has the total package. The choreography is fresh. I definitely think that we stand a huge chance to beat the Abby Lee Dance Company. I'm so nervous about the group dance. The group dance is the most important thing, and this has to go well. What did you say? The kid in the red red pants didn't know what they were doing? She knew. I wasn't. No, that's Paige. Paige generally doesn't know what she's doing. Anthony and Kathy are talking bad about Paige, and it's really ticking me off. I summoned Paige down off the stage. I thought that if Paige stood up to them, that he would rationally, as a grown adult, say, oh, honey, I'm sorry. I, I, I won't say anything else. I really did. It's because you were close to the wing. It looked like you were, you know, about to hit the wing, so you, it showed on your face. And uh -uh, uh -uh. You're not her dance teacher, so don't I'm give her critiques. Teacher, that's why I didn't Leave her alone. Her. Don't bring on my daughter. She does it enough. Yeah, well, I pay her for Good. her critiquing. Good, and you should. Not you. Maybe you should get a All right, look. This is a dance competition. You either need to leave the premises or you need to act like a lady and a gentleman. I've had it. I didn't really care that he was giving me corrections because it makes you a better dancer. I just didn't like that he did it in front of a whole audience because it kind of got me embarrassed. You called her down from the stage and had her confront them. She okay. was great. Do you want your kid just to be another pretty face, Kelly? My Don't you want her to have some pretty guts? face? Every day when you scream at her, she stands up to you. I'm very proud of Paige. She came down. She confronted this man. Okay, we'll begin scoring the junior's conference. Your first runner up with a score of 279.7 points is at number 50. And your high score in the junior's conference with a score of 280.1 points is at number 51. Hey, Ian Davis. I'm really happy that the group won. But most importantly, I get to see the look on Abby's face when we won and she lost. Everybody knows who Candy Apples is. And you know what? Nobody cares about Abby Lee anymore.
do you have any more passion or any more desire? There's a lot further for you to go. All of it.